Capricorn's listening some cards for you this week. Let's see what's coming out for my Capricorns this week. Oh, better shuffle. Deck just doesn't feel warmed up yet. For my Capricorns, my Capricorns. Let's get a side shuffle right in there. Let's go with it. It's for my Capricorns. What's going on with my Capricorns this week? Pop, we've got disorder. Disorganization, chaos, and turmoil. Disruption of peace. Clashing personalities and disagreements. Difficult times. And disruption of peace. Guys, ow. Let's see what else is coming out. It's for my Capricorns. Pop. We've got moon. Emotions are... And... Guys, okay. Emotions at an all-time high. Seeing past illusions. Hidden information and knowledge. Repressed feelings. Ooh, guys. Okay. Let me see what else is coming out here. Okay. Disruption of inner peace. Uh -huh. And third eye connecting with higher self. Spiritual insight and foresight. Seeing things crystal clear and intuitive guidance. The one, the one thing I'm going to say, guys, I don't know what it is. I don't know what the situation is, if it's, you know, what's going on. But we've definitely got something that triggers us, disrupts our intuition, our peace. We're going against our intuition of we're not saying anything. <laughs> we're not saying anything. And it, the emotions of it is going to start running high on us because we didn't vent it out. Or we didn't have a chance to vent it out. Uh-huh. Ooh, but we're wanting, we definitely want to say something, we needing to say something because that moon has, has us repressing what it is, and third eye is telling us we need to say something, the closure, the past will resurface to be dealt with again, final release and abandonment, cutting and severing ties, no more reliving painful memories, uh, we definitely are needing to say something in the situation uh, to be able to vent it out because we've got pressure building up on us uh, that is just going to disrupt our, our week guys it, it's going to like be just weighing on us of everything we're trying to do it's just in our thoughts and our feelings it's like I can't can't let this go till I can voice it and express it. Bottom of the deck, we've got forbidden, do not touch, prohibited from use, choose wisely, take an action, will have negative consequences. We're holding back for a reason because we know if we do vent something, it's, there's going to be repercussions of it. It's going, it's negative. Um, but we're feeling like we just need, we really need to vent it. We need to express it. We need to be heard on this. Is it a re It almost feels like this has happened more than once. That this energy has already been built up on us. And uh, we haven't said anything in the past. It's like we've got to just, you know, let something slide. Uh, and keep going in hopes that, you know, something will change. But whatever it is, it's triggered off again this week. And it's like, okay. Okay, I need to address this. There's some action needs to be taken on it, but um, we're definitely feeling like we can't. We can't just yet. Let's get the undercurrent energy. Let's let's get some of the shadow stuff going on here. Fake, false, and phony. That could be us pretending like everything's okay when it's not okay, or we're dealing with something that's fake, false, and phony. That's just putting on the appearance or putting on the performance of something when we're seeing through it. We're seeing through it. End of cycle and closure. Again, we need the closure. Mm -hmm. And we need the cycle, the pattern to end. So it is something that's reoccurring this week again for us when we were hoping it was just a temporary thing and it's becoming a cycle but we're definitely seeing seeing through it as somebody something or someone person place or thing is phony it's coming across as phony we've also got runaway and avoidance mm. we may have been in the runaway avoidance form yeah, that may be our energy but i also got a feeling it's uh both sides of the energy here of uh, 
I don't know what it is. Is it, is it job conditions? Is it working with someone? Is it a relationship? Something uh, where we are trying to avoid uh, negative consequences by taking action. Uh, they're in avoidance of addressing the issue. I'll say that it is an issue. We do feel betrayal, betrayed by it. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Bottom of the deck, what are we getting? Ghosting and silencing. Going silent, not talking about it. Uh, feeling like uh, we're left out in the cold. In a situation here. Mm. Okay, let's keep going. Let's see uh, what else will come out in the cards. When it comes to this. Mm -hmm. For my Capricorns. For my Capricorns, come in on that disturbed peace, inner peace. We got Rebel. Do it your way. Don't worry about what others think of you. It's time to write your own story. Ooh, we've been pushed, to, guys, to to not to not avoid it, not run away from it, to actually address it. Ah, let's come in on that moon. We've got happiness. Mm-hmm. Positive energy is flowing around you and within you. Stay optimistic. There's a lot of good coming your way. Coming your way. I want to come in on that happiness and that rebel. Tell me more about the happiness, the rebel here. Anything else? Yeah. Right here. Justice. Mm -hmm. Fairness. Libra energy. Justice will be done to those who oppose you. The truth will be revealed. Ooh, guys. It's time. It's time. With that one, I'm taking it as uh, no more passively just accepting things the way they are. It's time for you to uh, overcome a fear of negative consequences of, yeah, you're not going to be happy till you do. But do it in a graceful manner. Over here on a third eye, you've got support. Someone, someone will enter your life to help you and who has potential to become someone significant in your life. Others will support you if you if you go first, guys. Uh, this is sort of insinuating there's a lot of injustice done. It's not just to us. We do feel betrayed, but there's others in the same circumstances for some reason. Or it could be. But either way, we've got support if we will just go ahead and voice it. Uh, address, address it. And sometimes addressing it is simply just that, voicing it. You got star seed coming out on a support. Your essence is magical, appearing in multiple bodies, lifetimes, and dimensions. Believe in your magic. You make a big difference uh, in the situation if you will go on. And like I said, with the star seed, it's insinuating that it's not just about you being betrayed, but it may be the you also seeing an injustice of others being betrayed in a circumstance. If you voice it, it helps others some way. So yeah, bottom of the deck is your thoughts. Keep your thoughts positive. Move past your limiting beliefs and shift your energy to raise your vibrations. Yeah, don't deal with it in the same way. Uh, pattern needs to be stopped. It needs to be addressed and, and brought out into the open. Let's keep going, guys. Let's see what else will come out from my Capricorns this week. <clears throat> Coming in on that rebel, do it your way. <laughs> yes, and the justice. We've got Dolphin Spirit. Stop taking life so seriously and splash some joy into your life. Yeah, addressing it uh, will lighten up the situation, but also bring in that happiness and where we, do, we are not carrying such the heaviness of it with us. Let's come in on the moon, that moon card. All time high, you've allowed it to build pressure. Time to release. You've got um, make your mark. Stick to a decision and don't allow any obstacles to. Or, don't allow outside forces to sway you. Guys, my dyslexia is kicking in. Because it is an obstacle for you. And we're getting rid of the obstacle this week. You're making your mark. Mm -hmm. See what's coming in on over here. Ooh. 
temple of the soul. You're on your karmic path, so you can unravel the mystery of your karmic debts. But one more sticking out of the deck, success and triumph. Nothing will be able to get in your way. You will surely come out on top. Somebody's got your back. Somebody is like, yes, I'm, fi I'm finally glad somebody said something. Yes. Ow. Mm. Okay. Let's keep going, see what else will come out. This is for my Capricorns. Ooh, which hat turned over? You've always had the power. You just have to believe and own it. Coming in over here. Own it. Believe and own it. More powerful than you think. Mm -hmm. What else for my Capricorns this week? We got Skull. Real transformation requires real honesty to move forward in life. Yeah, the honesty of it. And don't don't fear consequences um, when you're standing in truth. What else? Oh, pop. Ritual bath. Spend some time alone. Regroup and listen to your inner wisdom. Oh, getting rid of that negative energy by venting it, but also relaxation. The dolphin spirit, some fun. Just getting away from it after you've vented it. Let's see what else will come out for you this week. This is for my Capricorns. Capricorns. Ooh, getting four here. Trust your intuition. Mm -hmm. Abundance is your right. It's your birthright, guys. Abundance. Mm -hmm. Your beliefs are right for you. Mm-hmm. And take responsibility for your actions. Take responsibility for your actions. Don't don't remain silent about something, guys, because uh, it, we may be, you know, being called upon to take action to advocate, so to say, for because, like I said, for some reason it's insinuating others will get a sense of relief um, and a sense of justice the balance back into their energy also with you taking action. You're here for a reasons on the bottom of the deck. Mm -hmm. You're in it for a reason. And it may be that you're the only one brave enough to go ahead and say something. To put it out there. <laughs> yes, let's get you a blessing this week. This is for my Capricorns. Oh, pop, hold on. We're going through the Oh, yes. Two. Three and five. Morgan's blessing of peace after battle. Yep, you got to go through the battle to get to peace. The inner peace where it was disturbed this way. You know how to bring it to yourself. Ooh, the ravens, three ravens. A blessing on your day. Mm -hmm. The lightheartedness, but also that's earth energy grounding things back into stability but lightheartedness a blessing to ease loneliness and bring companionship guys like i said somebody's showing up by you voicing helps someone else you've also got a blessing to find your way mm -hmm. i love that one a blessing to find your way she's in periwinkle guys uh periwinkle is patreon herb of magic mm -hmm. periwinkle Bringing in the blessings, finding your way. You also got a blessing on a resolution. Yes, you do. Go ahead and voice it this week, guys. Mm -hmm. You need to for your sake, but you're helping others when you do voice it. Don't let it slide again this week. Mm -mm. Let's get you a message from a spirit here. Your tribe that's got your back on the spirit realm. Ooh, message. Nurture your creative energy. Mm -hmm. Nurture your creative energy. What else it's for my Capricorns? My Capricorns. Top. Shift your focus mm -hmm. away from the negative. I shouldn't say anything. Yeah, you, you've got to say something this week. Your peace won't come till after the battle. Be of service to others. It will help others, most definitely. And feel the strength of your soul. Yes, 
Yes, you're here for a reason. You're in it for a reason and you're being nudged forward into the rebellion this week for a reason to help others. Help yourself also. Capricorns, y'all have a beautiful week. I hope it was helpful.